okay, this is the closest I've ever been to the camera, but there is a reason for it. I've done something crazy to my hair. I can't believe I did it, but I did it. Here is the process. I hope you guys enjoy it. Today is a very special day. I'm very nervous because, as you guys know, I've been growing my hair. And basically, my aim of growing my hair was to be able to tie it up in a bun. Now, my hair is at that point now. I can now officially tie it up in a bun. A small bun, but that was my goal. Long hair. Man. Again. You're literally so proud of that mini muffin. I'm so happy, it's taken a year! <laughs> it's literally taken a year to get this little raspberry at the back. It's obviously coming into summer in the UK and I've just been looking at my hair recently and just kind of, I'm done with it I think. And I kind of wanted a change so I messaged my hairdresser John and said, here's the idea that I have, what do you think? He called me straight away and said, I think we should maybe go for it. Let's give it a go. So here we are. So basically, I'm having something kind of crazy done to my hair that I, I've probably never had done. And you're gonna find out in today's video. I'm very nervous. <laughs> but do you know what? In life, you gotta try these things out. And it's good to be outside your comfort zone from, from time to time, I think. And that's how I'm feeling. And I think it's a good change. And I'm excited to, uh, yeah, to kind of enter a new chapter. I know it's only hair, but... Big change. Yeah? <laughs> nervous. You're nervous? It's going from this... ...to whatever comes next. This is all going. I'm nervous. I've been growing this for over a year. <laughs> so this is John, he's been cutting my hair for about 10 years and I wouldn't trust anyone else to do this. Yeah, yeah. My, my palms are sweaty. No. Honestly, my palms are sweaty. <laughs> it's been a long time. You know, you've become attached to things, don't you? Yeah. You know, when you've had something for a long time, you've become attached to it. But then, you know, like I said earlier, like change is good. Here it comes. Oh, no. Even that is weird. Are we doing it? We're well, too late now. <laughs> Oh my god! So that's it now. That's it. I bet you'll feel so much lighter. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Still properly getting rid of it. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, my friend. <laughs> we had some good times. Jimmy <laughs> Neutron. <laughs> It doesn't look bad at all. No. Boy, I don't mind it. No, I think I you look good. I actually don't mind it. Boy, we're doing it. I feel like I'm 12. <laughs> but I actually don't mind it. No. I know, look. Goodbye, Steve Tan. Guys, look at my hair. I actually really like it already. Almost there with it. Crazy. That is it now, it's no going back. This is your final finished look, yeah? Oh, nice love. Yeah. Oh, it's yellower than you think it's gonna be. Oh, is it? So yeah. It's, it's yellow. Okay, I'm nervous to show you guys. Here goes nothing. And here we go. This is the finished product. Welcome to my new look, I guess. Um, I'm so happy with the way it turned out. I was extremely nervous about doing this. Um, just because I've literally never had hair this short before. This is the shortest I've ever had my hair. But I actually love it. Like I actually really, really like it. Like I haven't been putting out videos as you guys know just because I've been doing this and I can't 
I couldn't put anything out because I needed to make this video first, actually revealing my hair, otherwise it would be totally random just like putting out a video with blonde hair and not having any explanation. But I just wanted a real big change, as you guys know I've been growing my hair for the last year, uh, year and a half um, and my main aim was to be able to tie it up into a bun, which I achieved, which you guys saw um, and yeah I kind of thought like I didn't want to cut it before I kind of achieved that goal so I managed to do it it was a small bun I know but I still managed to do it and that was always the aim so I just decided you know what I want to go crazy different the long hair was kind of frustrating me a little bit I know it was a mixed review actually from you guys some of you loved the long hair and some of you hated the long hair so let me know in the comments below what you think of this <laughs> because this is a crazy change like I said I really like it I've been waking up and being like oh what my hair's done that's cool um, and seeing friends they really like it as well and family really like it um, they're like whoa obviously it's very different um, just because I'm like so dark I'm obviously like very very dark brown hair um, and I was worried about how the blonde would actually work but I think it works I think it works I mean hopefully you guys too too Two, two, do two. So a massive thank you to John at Stone Hair and Flavia and all the rest of the team at Stone. They absolutely smashed it. Um, it was a great experience. And if you guys do want to go and get your hair cut or coloured, I'd highly recommend going there. It's Stone Hair in Kingston. I've been going there. Like John, I've known John for nearly ten years now, and he's cut my hair for the last ten years. So. Yeah, he was definitely supportive when I wanted to make this decision and he would, been, would have been the first person to tell me if he thought it would look rubbish or not. So he definitely was like, hey, I think you should go for it. I think we can make it look pretty cool. Um, and hopefully he was right. So yeah, I hope you guys like it. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And here's to the new chapter. And I think one thing I was thinking about when I was actually kind of contemplating whether to do this to my hair, I was like, in life you can be one of two people. You can be a person that wants to do stuff and kind of talks about it, or you can be the person who actually does stuff. And I kind of decided that I want to be one of those people in life that actually just go for it and do things that you kind of like that you want to do. This is something that I really wanted to do, and obviously it was massively out of my comfort outside of my comfort zone, and it was scary, and I was anxious about it, and I was worried about what people would think. But you know what? I think you've just got to go for these things and make them happen. Otherwise, you're gonna look back and be like I wish I should have done that. And do you know what? When I was 29, I wish I should have dyed my hair blonde and cut it off whilst I still could do that. Um, so yeah, I am a massive believer in that and I want to be one of those people's in, people in life that actually says things and does things and actually acts on them. So I will leave you with that. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Welcome to the new Steve, the blonde short hair Steve. It's kind of crazy. I hope you guys will get used to it. I'm still getting used to it. And I'll see you um, tomorrow, actually, for another video. Okay, guys, give this video a thumbs up if you have enjoyed it, and subscribe if you're new around here. Bye-bye. Take care. Okay, new hair. <laughs>